So Crunchyroll had their awards last night and lots of people were mad about the results, especially with how Boku no Hero won everything. Except not quite everything, but close enough for these people. Back in 2016, there was a similar reaction to Yuri on Ice winning so much. And while I am a big fan of My Hero Academia, as I would hope you know by now, even I will admit it did not deserve to win all these. The anime awards are, as a whole, a kind of weird entity. When you think about things like the Academy Awards, there it is the industry itself that picks the winners, while the Crunchyroll Awards are the fans who decide, both the fans who vote and also the judges who are people involved with different fan sites and such. This is bound to lead to the winners being mostly from popular series. If there is a category where I didn't see most of the nominations, then I would just vote for one from something I had seen. For example, the best villain category, of all the nominations, the only one where I actually saw all of it was for Stain from My Hero Academia, so I would be inclined to vote for him even if I actually don't think he is that great of a villain, though that's a topic for another video. Most people who vote are in the same position as me. They have not seen everything that has aired. Even I have not seen a lot of these, and I am trying to check out as much as I possibly can. So that means we'll just vote for the ones we have seen, which will cause the popular shows to be inflated. So, how could this be stopped? Well, one solution would be to take the fan vote away. Only have the judges decide the winners, which I don't like this idea. With a small pool of judges, you can make sure they've actually seen everything to avoid just popular shows being voted on, but this leads to the decisions not being by with the community as a whole thinks, only these judges who may or may not reflect the community as a whole. And this doesn't really feel right if we want these awards to reflect all of the Western audience. With the Academy Awards, none of the nominees for Best Picture for this year were big blockbuster hits. In fact, all the nominations combined made less than the Star Wars movie. So there's an obviously big divide between the critics who decide what is nominated and wins and what the average person goes to see and enjoy. And as film theory discussed a while back, it it is possible to make a movie that appeals to the Academy, allowing it to have a better shot of winning, despite not being that popular with the moviegoers. So, do we want the Anime Awards to be more like the Academy Awards? Well, I don't. This is probably the biggest opportunity for fans to come together and decide what they think are the best anime of the year. I know there are a lot of the community that don't agree with the anime that were selected, but that's the one any vote. Just look at the elections. And while it might be nice if the Anime Awards were able to highlight more obscure shows, that's kind of what we as the community do. I mean, it worked with Made in Abyss, a show that had very little fanfare at the start, but it won Anime of the Year and has spread throughout the community so that pretty much everyone has seen it, and I would say the vast majority of people really love it. And even if the awards were chosen just by judges, there would still be outrage that the judges picked the wrong thing. Because we all have different tastes. Yes, there are a lot of the community who love shonen anime, and that means that Book No Hero wins a lot. But say your judges were big fans of drama and all that, then you would have outrage from those who like thrillers that their picks were not selected. So yeah, you can't win with this. But really, how much do the awards matter? It's not like your favorite show not winning takes away from how much you enjoyed it, or that you would enjoy it more if you won. I love My Hero Academia the same amount before it won these awards. So if you want your favorite anime to get more recognition, then go make that happen. Make a video, post on Twitter, tell your friends, share on Twitter, all that. One of the things that sets the anime community apart from other mediums is the vast majority of advertisements for these shows is by the fans. I choose anime I want to watch because of what I've heard from friends, or found through fan sites, or just music I found on YouTube that a fan uploaded. Not some big company telling me I should go watch this show. So yeah, that's my thoughts on the whole Crunchyroll Awards thing this year. Tell me what you thought down below. And please like, subscribe, and share this video if you want to help my channel grow. It really does. It really would mean a lot. Anyway, thank you for watching, and I will see you all next time.